What's going on Dream Crew family? Welcome to another beautiful day out here in LA. It is so gorgeous outside. It is a little chill, a little, little chilly and I'm kind of sad I had to throw on a jacket because I wanted to show on this dope ass Star Wars vintage shirt I have on. The vibes are nice. I do want to start the vlog out by saying I'm starting something new on the vlog. So basically this is what we're going to do is, you know, YouTube messes up time to time a lot actually lately and like videos don't go to your sub box. So everybody should turn on their notifications. If you don't know what a notification is, it's like it goes straight to your phone and it emails you and it tells you right when I upload the vlog. So what we're going to do is if you turn on your notifications, comment down below, say you're part of the notification crew every day in the vlog I'm gonna shout out one of you guys as the high beast of the day I said we make like a set of the diet starts tomorrow boxing Sorry, classes yeah Boxing class. So we're at Boopa de Beko right now. Boopa de, Boopa de Beko. <laughs> I don't know, I just know the food is good here. Don't worry, I'm not eating pasta or anything. I got chicken. But anyway, yeah, we're just grubbing, chilling, talking, business plans, merch plans, merch ideas, SneakerCon SF merch. <laughs> we already have SneakerCon London merch, SneakerCon SF merch, SneakerCon Phoenix merch, and Cleveland is this weekend, so it's gonna be lit. <laughs> We need sprinkles are for pets. Oh, that's a cool background. Take a picture right there. Instagram. Trying to control my urges. I'm, for the first time, I'm not the one getting the big dessert. I hit the, I went to the gym this morning, guys. But I didn't vlog it because I don't want to... You did come? Yeah, I did. I went to the gym this morning, yeah. What Me did the membership to you? No, no, at my apartment. <laughs> what did you have membership to waste? No, Equinox doesn't charge me because I got a new card, so like they don't have my information to charge me, you feel me? Damn. Cupcake goals. They got this Lambo here. I don't know if this is a person. This isn't a person's car, right? This is like they're selling this? Why would they sell cars? 500k? If all my subscribers give me one dollar, I can afford this car. There you go. From only one channel too. Yeah, guys, are you down? So we just pulled up to Melrose right now. We about to hit up like round two and uh, see what they got. Never know, every day they got new stuff up in there. So maybe pull out with some more. I got my shirt from there, if you guys remember. Farouk needs to get some vintage. You need some hype beast stuff, fam. This is hype beast shopping on Melrose. GM Loki might leave with more stuff than all of us tonight. He's the biggest hype beast on the low. Look, he's got an ultra boost on. Shout out to Sunhand for him. I still need to pay him for him. Damn, scam <laughs> artist. Another hype beast on Melrose. Swag's back. Let's go, swag. All right, guys, we in round two right now. First thing that caught my eye was this OVO. Yes, I do have a pair from Jordan brand, but this pair right here is used. So I would definitely prefer to buy these so that I can use these and wear them a lot. This is my size, nine and a half. They're going for 450. Let me see if I can get them for a little bit less than that. All of a sudden. All right, guys. So I ended up walking out with the OVOs. Got them for four hundred dollars, double the retail price. But that's still a steal, I feel like, because they're going for like six, seven hundred dollars. I wanted to get another pair so that I can wear them a lot. So I want to make it like a beater. Might even have to wear these to the next hoops classic. You feel me? You never know. Secret called might come to Toronto. I've said too much. We're still walking down Melrose, still doing more hypey shopping. You know when you go shopping with your friends and you like encourage your friends to buy things but they never can find anything that's how I feel today right guys yeah man yeah totally. yeah way to go take L's or no we yeah, bounce we back you. you always take L's fam never bounce back so I'm walking guys and I see this ugly guy on the billboard who is that guy who is that guy why would why would they allow that ugly guy to be up there. Who? How much do they have to pay to let them, the city of Los Angeles, let them put that face Probably up there? A lot of money. 
an ugly face, guys. The funny thing about this billboard is it's gonna be up there for like four weeks, and the event was three days ago, so we're getting a lot of promo for something that ended, but it's it's all good. I'm not tripping. My face is all Melrose. All right, so we're at Cool Kicks now, and I want these, but I'm not trying to pay 400 for these. I know they go for like 400 plus, but at first I didn't even like these, but now I do like these. Uh, they're a shoe that you definitely need to see in person, but I don't know. They're just, they're just. I think they're, they're like an everyday wear. It's just not, I don't think I want to pay $400 for those, but another dope shoe that I like is this right here. This is old school meets 2017. I had these in my car. But yeah, you told me that. Let's just say GMU's bots. These are the new Kith Naked collabs right here. It's a very different and weird shoe. There's no laces, but you know, whatever. Someone's hair is frizzy from the LA weather, huh? We got two very dope sneakers, two of my favorite Ultra Boosts that have released in a very, very long time, and I'm really excited that I got them, so I'm gonna go get them right now. Can you watch the camera while I leave real quick? Oh, you gotta come with me. All right, come with me, come on, let's go. All right, we got two sneakers to unbox here. Here, open this one. There you go. Oh. <laughs> Fail. I had to pay resale on these, but we got the Silver Ultra Boost, AKA the Super Bowls. I don't call these the Super Bowls. And people went crazy for them, and then they realized that they're not that limited. Pretty much. Silver Ultra Boost is dope. They, they these are going for like like three hundred fifty dollars. Now they go for like two hundred fifty dollars. So I paid two hundred forty dollars for these, and then I actually found them in store for retail. But it wasn't my size, but I still paid two hundred fifty dollars for these. But these are freaking dope. These ones, I didn't even know it comes in this box, but this freaking box is sick. Like, look, it just looks like a mirror. Like, you can see my camera. Wow, that's a weird thumbnail. This is the craziest Ultra Boost unboxing you will see. Look at this box. It's like a every angle, every side of the box is reflective mirror. And I didn't even know they came in this box until I got them. We got these off Adidas.com. Shout out to Ahmed's plug. He did his thing and he helped us get this. Look, it even has a little handle on here, which is so freaking dope. And I'm just gonna go ahead and open it up because these are my favorite Ultra Boosts that have came out in a very, very long time. Bam! They did the pitch. This is the, the this is a real pitch black upper, like 3.0 pitch black upper with this freaking blue, like very, very beautiful blue cage. And then you've got the like the lime breed vault lining with the pink inner or the purple inner. And then the thing that tops it all off is that it has the black boost with the red bottom. Bruh, well, it's like more of like an orange, but also something that they have right here that they have on the gold metal ultra boost is the gold heel cup. I think that just makes it pop off because without that, it's like whatever. And then you just see that gold and you're like, oh my God. And I'm really happy that I got these, even though retail was 250. So with tax and everything, they came out to 270. Yeah, I'm really, really happy I got both of these. I haven't actually got any ultra boosts in a minute. I got some and I returned them, but these are definitely two of my favorite that I've gotten. Yeah. I've been a rich man and I have been a poor. 